Good afternoon everyone, welcome back to another train simulator live stream. So good morning driver, today we're taking a class 506 on a commuter service from Manchester Piccadilly to Hadfield via Glossop. Uh, setting up the unit and yeah there we go. So yeah big thanks to Dovetail Games for giving us the key for the Woodhead Electric. We've been looking forward to this one. Um, yeah this one is set I think in the 70s. Uh, so we've got, we've got an old 506, it's pretty cool. And why why on earth is that? Let me try and find the chat. It's it was loading up. It was taking like forever. Um. Okay, we can do that. It's a funny looking train as well. Look at this. And you've got different codes to it as well. Um. Manchester or Hadfield via Glossop. We're going that way, aren't we? Well, at the moment we're empty. I think empty train. At the moment we're empty. I think. So we might have to change it as we go along. So we are, where are we at the moment? We are in in the depot at the moment. Let's get in. Uh, let's start. We've got a uh, red at the moment. Oh no, we got a change in, haven't we? Did it, say to change? it did say to change in, didn't it? Let's have a look. Um, yeah, it's no good if we're there. I think it said to change in. I can't remember now. I think it said set the, uh, set the tail lights for this. There we go. Literally just that. <laughs> change ends. There we go. Uh, so we are empty at the moment. So empty train. Set to that. I don't want the brakes alike like on here. Probably fairly dodgy. Inch. Oh, there we go. Anyway, let's see what we have got in the chat. Uh, we have got... Uh, scrolling up. we got William, Taco, Lesjet, Australia, NG, Luke, uh, Laserjet, E60, Glenn... How's everyone doing? Do tell me about audio as well. It's fairly quiet. Oh, so, uh, uh, a weird horn. It's a weird train. Yeah. Yeah, another old train. Weird interior as well. The Pennine Electric route. Out we go. Manchester Piccadilly next. Be a big fancy dovetail games for giving us a key for this. So to Manchester Piccadilly it's quite a way actually. We got well four miles, but we're doing that thirty two. And then we're going up to Hadfield, which is over there. Hello Jack. Good tier with him, good tier all good. Can we speed up? So is the back one different? I think it's just delivery slightly different. Yeah. Out to 45. Oh. There we go. We are off. See, I think this is in the 70s this is set. It is a weird looking train, isn't it? Got a 30 coming up. Let's get him. Oh. I don't want the brakes are like though. I reckon they're probably lapped, aren't they? They do sort of look like it. Is there even a gauge? A little one there. Not a lot to them. Uh, I don't know, William, I don't know. Is it a strange train? Very strange. Anyone ever go on one of these? And we've got a 15 coming up as well. There's a car in the bloody canal there. we go. So in a bit then. Enjoy. Or we'll try to. Uh, I don't know whether I'm not too sure. Probably will be another stream. Right, let's test the brakes. What are they like? Okay, I got that fairly simple then. I thought that might be lapped. But no. Just normal brakes.
So we have got a bit of a way to uh, Manchester Piccadilly. <laughs> if you want, ladies and gentlemen, yeah. They are weird, aren't they? Hey, Daniel, I'm all good. How are you, mate? Might be fairly quiet as it was a fairly sort of late scheduled one. So. Got a semaphore there as well, so it seems to be a bit of a mix on this route. So we're going right round on ourselves then. By the looks of things, we've just gone right round there. Have to look at the map in a sec. Yeah, we've literally just gone right around on ourselves. Pretty cool. Yeah, it is Joseph's birthday today, yeah. Uh, not too sure, Daniel, yeah, not too sure, mate. There's the APC. Can we get the window open? We can. Well, fairly intensive route this one yeah a little bit intensive go on yeah we went right around there didn't we let's have a look yeah so it's gone right around there so we're there now and into Manchester over there We're doing there at 32, so in about 10 minutes. So I'm guessing we'll be coming back along here then. Yeah. On we go. It is a fairly intensive route. Look at that, 25 PS along here. Hello GTA, you're on the South Fork branch, lovely. On horseshoe then. Gorton. Yeah, it's about an hour long this scenario. Is there another street? I don't know, Jack. Yeah, I don't know. Not too sure. I mean, most likely. But I don't know when. Very dirty, the wind. I've just noticed how dirty the windscreen is. I thought that was like smoke in the distance coming out of those chimneys, but no, look at that. All that dirt there. Afternoon, Decker, I'm all good. How are you? Yeah, it's fairly intensive though, this bit on the on the game. It comes down to 30. Hey, Twisted Welsh, have you have you done the Liverpool crew on TSW yet? Yes, a few times. And what's my thoughts on it? A good, uh, a good start for Steam. <laughs> you get the sponges and we clean the windows. Yeah, probably should. Filthy. And pop that down. I'm guessing we'll probably have a red coming in as we are a little bit early. And then yeah, Manchester PC, once we arrive and to change ends, make sure to set the headlights, tell us and destination display correctly before leaving for Hatfield. Will do. Is a peculiar train. Yeah, little. There's not much. Yeah, that's true. There's not much of a windscreen wiper, is it? <laughs> I think it's about halfway along. You sort of have to lean up a little bit to look out if it was raining. A few semaphores, lovely. Let's have a look at the map. See, so we're there. So we're at Ardwick. There's the Ardwick depot, and then that goes down towards Liverpool. I think down that way. You got the Manchester Piccadilly, Manchester Oxford Road. So he's got that route. No, it does, doesn't it? It does. Just 
So we're going to the left here. Or straight on, actually. Yeah, we're back. Back on. But we'll be due out of at 35. Seems a bit of excessive of a weight. This is the class 506. Yeah, it's class 506. Weird, isn't it? wonder when these got retired. I suppose we'll be in the 90s or maybe even 80s. What do I like about this route? Well, first time on it, so... Don't have an opinion on it. A bit laggy coming in. Nice decker. Very peculiar train. There's the map up there though. Where's Manchester? I read the L Manchester there. So I got up to Hadfield, wherever that is. Nice sounds though. Here we are, Manchester Piccadilly. Got a few more here as well. I think you also got the class 76 on this route. I think it's the class 76 you get on here. Oh, really? <laughs> There's been an error. Ah. I mean, is there any of these preserved? It does, doesn't it? I like it. Fair enough. So we're out for in seven minutes. There we go, we did it. All those doors opening. That was cool. <laughs> awesome decker. Right, let's get the marker lights on them. This is Manchester Piccadilly. Mm, so we just release that. Hopefully it's not downhill. And we'll change ends. That arm. So you got different sort of lights on this at Cambridge, lovely. We are, yeah. Uh, so we're going to Hadfield, we are, via Gossip. Um, Manchester because of the end, Gossip. Yeah, there we go. I think that's our one we need. Gossip. Where's Gossip on here? I'm pretty sure it was going. We were going via gossip, wasn't it? Yeah, via gossip. There we go. Can we change that up there? Can we change the destination? Oh, well, we can. There we go. Hadfield. That was good. That was lucky. It was the next one. Hello, Steve. How are you? Nice. So the back one can say Manchester. Little luggage area there. Yeah, I mean the, well, I don't know if we've got a 505 and a 506 together. I think this is a 506. It's a weird looking train, isn't it? One of the strangest looking British units I've seen. Let's have a look at the route map. So we're there, and we're going to Hadfield, which is there. So, wow, the route goes quite a way, doesn't it? I don't know if that's for passengers the rest of the way. Can't see any sort of stations. So any passenger stations along here? Looks like it's all freight most of the way. 
Yeah, there's like no passenger stations that then goes to Woodhouse. What about this next one? What, what, any passenger on it? No, that's all freight. Waff. That's how you say it. You've got a station here. What's that? That is Penistone. Yes, yeah, so we're going. We're not going much of the way up. We're going. Oh, where's this way? You got Dinting, and then Glossop there. Wait, hang on. We're going into Glossop, aren't we? Yeah. So hang on. That's quite cool. So we have to reverse. Well, we're going into there. Then we have to then go back up. That'll be cool. Oh, lovely, yeah, Steve, very nice. Uh, it was in service from 1954 to 1984. Fair enough, Damien, I'm all good. So we've got a bit of a wait here. Can we try and get up to 20 lights? I don't know, you 60. I don't know. It's got no bell to it. Lovely. Fairly nice, cosy passenger area, though. Doors like they're shut from this bit, from this um, angle. <laughs> yeah, so we've got four minutes and then we'll be due out. So we've got Gorton, Fairfield, Guidebridge, Newton. Uh, is that Newton? Uh, Godley, Hattersley, Broadbottom, Dinting, Glossop, uh, and then Hadfield. Which from here is about 45 minutes away. Well, I'm going to enjoy it. I think we're going to enjoy it. I think it's going to be a nice run. I've not seen much of this route. Get the window open. Got a pen and a pacer. What's all this here? Control key switch. Oh, hello. Whoa. Let's not break the train. Train line key. Pantograph stuff. Hey, cheers for that, Lima. Uh, 10,000 Indian rupees. Which is 61 pence. Cheers, um, uh, Lima. After available. Ah. How you doing, Lima? Hopefully you're well. Cheers for that. Hello, Pep. How are you? Yeah, I thought this was slam door. Yeah, cheers, Lima. I don't know if Lima does do anything. I suppose flights him. Check him out. Uh, 61 pence, Damien. Not too long, I'll be off. Uh, we've got the green already. Yeah, this is uh, 506, this is. I wonder if I see any other trains coming in. I know it's fairly quiet. Got a few coaches here. Newspapers. Cool. Two minutes. And then we are off. So we're in Manchester at the moment. Let's have a look at the outside. Yeah, so a fairly grandish station. With like a block of flats on it. <laughs> and you got Manchester Piccadilly here, then Oxford Road, which is down there. Which we'll see it doesn't go on this route. Cool. Don't play it on our lines. Easy guard to motor rail. Well, that's quite cool, isn't that? Little map there. St. Austell there, I think there is. Dover. That's yeah, quite cool. So you could go from wherever that is up there, Stirling, I think that is, all the way to Dover or Brockenhurst. Put your car on the train and it would be taken there. That would be a cool idea for sort of nowadays. Hello, Snowman, how are you? I have, yeah. That sounds quite cool, Moto Rail. Did anyone ever do that?
30 seconds. And then we shall leave. How you doing, snowman? 10 seconds. Alright. There you go. Oh. Cool. Let's get a love other than the card buzzer. And we're off. Is anyone living? I mean, is this line even a, around anymore? I'm guessing it probably is. Well, I know Manchester Piccadilly is, but to Hadfield, Dinting, and Gossip. Goss Out we go. Goodbye, Manchester. I don't think there is any AWS on here. I doubt it. Lovely. Alright, you 60. Yeah, that never really worked out. And then the HST came about. goes up to 30 slightly quicker which is good and Gorton is in must be quite a way where is it Gorton where where it usually pops up no clue let's have a look on there oh two and a half or so miles away love the sounds from in here all right, bet. Last three, two, threes. Yeah, the, ele the Pennine Electric route. Now it's fifty. <laughs> you see, sixty. Couple of stations were missing out. So how far is Manchester Victoria from Manchester Piccadilly? Are they fairly close or? That one goes off down there. And up 250. Anyway, a nice run though. Especially for the first time on this route as well. I think this route came out in 2017 to the game. And there's also the really old version of this route as well. By Thompson Interactive, which I think is set in the 50s or so. And let's go. That's going up nicely. Uh, also, what do people think the roadmap is going to be like next week? You have to think it'll be a really big, like a new yearly update announcement or something? Yeah, not too sure, Damien. It's a bit weird the way it did get pushed back a week, though, isn't it? A bit sort of suspicious. Don't know. Yeah, so you've got a mix of semaphore and colour lights. How much is this route? Uh, I think it was £17 on the Steam store. Hello, Krasa. That means stop, doesn't it? I'm pretty certain one, one buzz means stop. So we don't know where we're stopping. The guard has to be like, oh yeah, we're stopping there. Give him a buzz. Hello, Avnish. Yeah, I wonder why the guard gave us a buzz there. Does the driver not know where they're stopping? Or maybe the guard does it to remind the driver. As yeah, fairly close. 
Well, coming up to Gorton. Is the BML on train sim? Yeah, London to Brighton. A bit like a bus route. Yeah, someone's buzzed to get off. <laughs> is East Coast Fair on train sim? No. Oh, yeah, we go. The brakes seem alright on it. Yeah, very strange train. Especially if you sort of compare it to the way the ones in the south would have looked like the class 411 or the 412, the 421, 422, 423. This is like way different. Of a pantograph on. That would be called the West Coast way. Six coaches long they are. Let's try not to overshoot. That wouldn't be any good. Well, the brakes seem decent though, so. I guess it's to the end of the platform. Oh, hang on a sec. It says we've gone past the platform. No, but this is the platform. It's weird. In fact, yeah, if we had stopped there, it would have been off the off the platform. That's a bit weird. Looks like you had another couple of lines there. He was watching Indonesia versus Singapore in the AFF Under-16 Cup match on win 9 it? Wow. Quite a bit, then. I don't know, he's 16. I don't know. Or does it be like Southeastern or something? So yeah, there, that's where we come down, wasn't it, from the depot? Yeah, is this older than Omsi? What, train sim? Uh, about the same time. Guard? I'm waiting for the guard. No? I'll do it then. Fairfield next. Now he does it, really. Hello Richard, how are you? Now this is a fairly intensive route, this is. Oh, if we get in the cab, I suppose we are in the middle of the city of 30-ish. It's quite, yeah, an intensive route. And it's quite detailed, isn't it? Quite a big sort of area around here as well, so. Cool. Not too far to Fairfield. You gonna be joining the convoy tomorrow, Richard, on the Montana? Well, I think Hadfield, once we. It should improve as we get out. I think we'll be going into the countryside. How you doing, Daniel? Says we're up your way, aren't we, on this? About well, ish. <laughs> Just is GTA. One of the older electrics. It does look good. Yeah, the country roads on there look good. Very nice. I don't think there is actually many highways. So I'm looking forward to it. Yeah, the brakes are pretty decent. So, fair enough. Awesome. What time? Well, hopefully as soon as it comes out, which someone said about 6pm. So, around then. I don't know how long we'll be going for, probably about an hour and a half, two hours. Um, so yeah, probably will end up being about an hour and a half. Then we'll be back hopefully after that, depending on how much fun it is. Here we are. That sort of comes out a bit of a dodgy time, so. Is that a train over there? It is. 
What's that, 76? I, d I don't know them too well, these ones. I don't know what's that there. Hello, GT. Hello, guy. How are you? This is Fairfield. This is Fairfield. I do, Krasner. Timeless penalty. Come on. Awesome, Richard. The guard was awake this time. Guide bridge next. What's that? Is that the cab light there? What's that? Compressor. What's that? Uh, compressor. No. Compressor. Governor bypass. Sounds fancy. Accelerates fairly quickly, doesn't it? Sort of up to about 30 or so. Bit random track there. Alright, GTA. Do I have all DLC on train sim? No. There's like 600 DLC and they're just official DLCs. Imagine all the third party ones on top. Class 76, eh. Uh. Just woke up, fair enough, guy. Just like Daniel, then. Just got up. So, heading into sort of the country now. Sort of heading out of Manchester. Lovely guy, very nice. A bit close to the window on here, don't we? I'm sure, we're slightly further back. Nice, oh, Richard. Even all the truck ones as well. Comes down to 35. How many do you have around? What do you mean? Oh, how many DLC do I have for train sim? I'd say probably about 100 or so. I definitely spent like near enough a grand on this game over the years. Oh blimey laser jet. Am I folding in my tripod? What's that noise that can it? That's not the train, is it? So it could be the compressor going. I think it is the train making that noise. No, that can't be the train. That was a foot. Oh, it's an 08. It's an 08. Awesome. Oh, Alright. Definitely Krasner. Oh, blimey. There's an 08 over here. Gorton. A few little bits there. Cool. I haven't seen our passenger train yet. Quite noisy, isn't it? Making a real racket, you are right, uh, the OA over there. Nice match. Why is there a speedboard in the platform? Right, Newton next. Not the Newton in Scotland, though. No. Oh, SpongeBob doesn't want to get off. She's there now. Uh, I'd say so, Kenzie. Yeah, I mean it's my favourite US route. It's a uh, nice one, scenic, fairly fast as well. No, oh Smudge, what are you doing? Disaster strikes. Afternoon, Amanda. They bully the Gronks. Up to seventy-five. Yeah, Newton is next. Yeah, Smudge is right on the desk at the moment, so. That goes, goes to 50. It is, Richard, don't worry, mate, it is. Go on, there's a nice chair over there. Yeah, no, she's like, no, I'm staying on here. Well, I guess Smudge is staying on there for now. <laughs> Lovely, uh, Amanda. You can go anywhere but the keyboard. Oh, 
That's there you go, go over that side. Bit more of a distance to the next station. Newton. He's all over the desk. Afternoon Dapper, how are you? What's that noise? There's something else. Maybe another train. There she goes. Must be another train, mustn't it come out? Sounds like a steam train. Maybe it's the factory. Or the smoke billy um, coming out. Must be. Lovely. It's a nice route though, isn't it? Join this. Well, not too far to Newton. Looks like we're all uphill now. Good to Dapper and all good. There's some different ones. There you've got in Inch, Series, Parallel and weak field. That should be Shunt, shouldn't it? Inch. So it's to inch forward a little bit. Now this is the Woodhead Electric Line, Daniel. In BR Blue. Manchester Piccadilly, we're going as far as Hadfield. Well, it looks like it goes quite a far way onto somewhere called Wa Waff, Wolf, something like that. It's in the Pennines. I don't know, there's just some point. That's what we got a stop marker here. Them on just a little bit, not not too much, not too much, and come to a stop. There we go. Oh, the window is the window. There you go. Get them open again. There we go. A little area there in the back. Here we are at Newton. Yeah, uh, this goes from Manchester Piccadilly to all the way over here, uh, which is what's this place called? Waff. -wa I don't know how you say that. Um, and also down here to Rotherwood. But minus 481 for, I thought we were doing well. Wow. Hello, lucky boy, how are you? Because we better get going. How many British routes? There's a lot of British routes on here. Oh, viaduct, fun. There it goes, got cows there in the background as well. Cool. Your coat, oh, come on, bloody hell. Sorry to hear, uh, lucky. So you haven't been too lucky there then. But yeah, I'm all good. Hopefully it's not too bad. Uh, no, you're not the fake David off, mate. I don't know why we're all obsessed about fake accounts. <laughs> it happened like once. I can tell if someone's fake by the way they put chat in. Right down. What do you think of this? It seems quite nice, seems quite pleasant. Fair enough, uh, Krasa. Very close together, these stops. Uh, 
Hey, ghost, you love this route. Fair enough. I mean, it, it looks very nice. I think this is set in the 70s. I believe. Oh, is that a red for us? No, that's not a red for us. Uh, we're six coaches, aren't we? What does everyone prefer? Woodhead Electric in BOR Blue or the original Woodhead route? Here we are. Is Cathcart on here? Uh, no. Although you do get the other sort of bits which aren't on Cathcart on TSW. Here we are. This is Godly. Hello, Kaylee. How are you? Hello from Sheffield. Hopefully, you're all well. How are you doing? Right, let's have a look. Is there any, there's not even like a blind on here. It's very, very basic. It says it was sort of built to be basic. Uh, we've got Godly, uh, Hattersley, Broadbottom, Dinting, Glossop, uh, and then um, more minus points as well in Hadfield. Let's go. Did anyone ever go on a 506? It looks very rickety and... Yeah. <laughs> like they're about to fall apart. The next stop is just there. That's like an island platform as well. On we go. Frame rate's much better now as we're out of sort of Manchester. You've walked this for uh, route a few times. Sad that it's disappeared. Oh, has it? I thought this was um, well still about this route. From whereabouts is it gone now? Then does it not, none of this exist now? Then is there British steam? There is on this route. Uh, no, on this game. Yeah, that's good then, lucky. I think this is set in the 70s, so when did this shut then? So we're right to the end we are. And... Yeah, it would be quite cool, Quicko. I mean, it's northern, it's electric. Um, it's good. I wouldn't mind it. Wasn't preserved there. Uh, oh, the Sheffield side of the woodhead is no longer. Uh, but yeah. I don't know if this one even goes to Sheffield. It goes to Rotherwood and Wharf or Waff. I don't know how you say it. Ten pound is it? It's all right then. I wonder when they're going to bring out Texas, because that sort of seems like Montana sort of overtook that. Broad, but a broad bottom next. So we are. So it goes quite a way, but the passenger trains ain't only go to here. Or to Hadfield, where we're going. So then we have to go into here, to Glossop, and then. And then Hadfield's there. Maybe that's where... No, the electric wouldn't run out there, would it? Hello, Joseph. How are you? Smudge is looking up with her sort of big eyes. Hey, Smudge. She's coming back up. Hey, Joseph, the birthday boy. Welcome back. Is that a road bridge up there? Wharf. I got yeah, Wharf. Well, yeah, it goes to Wharf and Ravens. Something I can't remember the other place now. Rotherwood. Yeah, Rotherwood and Wharf. That's true, Richard. And coming into Broadbottom. Bottom. 
fairly short platform, I think. Yeah, Case is back. And here we are. Cool. Yeah, did anyone ever go on one of these? I think it probably would have been fairly comfy. Surely we're going to hit that wall, aren't we? Mm, just about. That was free. I don't know what free buzzes means. <laughs> Do free back. Not yet, quick, eh? Yeah, we're on the platform. So, yeah, that, that we, put, we will do another stream after this. I'm going to go and chill out in the garden after this, enjoy a bit of the weather, a nice cold drink, a nice cup of tea, and then, um, yeah, I might come back with something. Uh, Mottom Yard. Okay, we're going into a yard to drop off the rear unit. That's not on the instructions. Mottom yard. Mottom yard. I have no idea, no idea where that is. Oh, there's Mott Ram there, so I'm guessing we're going in there. Okay, well we can do that. So I suppose if you're in the back unit, you're screwed. You're going to be sat in the yard until it gets taken again. Now oh, see, Pep. Where's this yard then? Right, we're there, so we're going to be going into there then, and dropping off the rear unit. Not sure. We'll see where it takes us. Hello, Ben. Look at that. I don't know if it will slow down though in a sec. A little viaduct. Wow, look at this. Brilliant. Lovely, isn't it? Still climbing up. Okay, I don't think we are going in there. But it said drop off the rear unit at Mottram Yard. Hello, uh, fishies, how are you? Hmm. Very nice, so. I think we've got a bit of a way up then to Dinting. Well, not too far. So we're two Hotel 78, but then it said we're going to drop off the rear unit and it's become two Hotel 77. So there must be a gossip, maybe, or gossip we do the other one. I suppose once we, once we get to Glossop, this unit will be uncoupled, and then we'll go into the other one, or something like that. And then we do the little shuttle up to uh, Hadfield. Little station there. Probably a staff station, that one, isn't it? Another question for chat, when did the Class 76 get retired? I'm going to guess probably 80s as well. Guess that's a warning board for a 40. Is that on the old Woodhead route? Because this is Woodhead Electric, but I know there is the Thompson Interactive one as well. I don't know, does that one go to Sheffield? Now this is a class 506, first time driving one. And I quite like it, I quite like it. Oh wow, look at this coming across here. It's beautiful, isn't it? I mean, this is very, look how high up we are here. Wow. 
Right, right uh, kick, uh, yeah, bring that down to 10. Doesn't really matter about points, we're running late, so we're gonna get minus anyway. Look how high up we are though. I guess this is the Dinting Viaduct. Wow, we're flying. This is very impressive up here. So I guess we're going down to there, Dinting. Maybe that's Dinting down there. Oh no, this is Dinting, a Glossop. I guess the Glossop is down, that little bit down there. Is this station still about then in real life, and Glossop? I feel like they would have sort of been two to be sort of axed. What a lovely station. Listen to that as we come in. Sounds brilliant. Oh, of course, like fairly early then. Here we are. This is Dinting. Got the curl on that platform there. Very nice. So what I'm, I'm guessing at Glossop we detach this unit and then we go into that one and that's the little shuttle up to Hadfield. So it definitely says something about uncoupling. Hey, we got one at uh, plus points. Hey, that's fine. You're meowy, go on there. There you go. Probably wants to go out. We're almost there. Camera off. I don't know if you can see this much. Hello. Be about 10 minutes, much. Uh, oh, um. DP Sim have Sheffield Wood headline. Cool. That's not set, is it? I swear that wasn't set the right way. It certainly looked like it. It's down into Colossus. Don't know how far down this is, but. We're going down there. Fifteen. It's a little bit better. Okay, how far to gloss up then? Oh, less than a mile. Yeah, it's just a line to get down into the town. Otherwise, you'd have to walk all the way up to Dinton, I guess, if you live down here. Yeah, the 304s, they're the one on the third row ones, aren't they? Get that up. We're going to Hadfield, so we have to reverse back up here. Well, not reverse, but just change cabs. I'll let you out in a second, then, Smudge. She's just meowing. Yeah, in a minute. We're almost at, we're almost at Glossop. Yeah, she knows. Cool. Nice match. Hello. She's back again. <laughs> I'll let her out once we get into uh, this station. Hello. And this is Glossop. 
Which I'm guessing we'll get a message pop up. And it just takes you down into the uh, into the town. Is this station still about then? I feel like this one probably isn't anymore. Seems like a fairly sort of quiet little branch which we would have been axed. Fairly nice, though. Well, the station looks a bit run down. You've got rubbish all over the track. Let's not hit the buffer now. I'm stopping there. I'm not stopping right at the stop marker because I don't have tears. Tears can be a bit funny sometimes. It might, if I go there, it might say I've gone for a red light. Right. Let me let out Smudge. We've actually got uh, two minutes here. So let me quickly go and do that. I'm actually continue to meow, meow, meow. Let me quickly let out. Look at the little entrance there to the station. Hold on, everyone. Yeah, we've got about a minute and a half here. I'm guessing I have to change ends, but of course I have to change ends. We're not going to reverse up, are we? Um, let's change that to that. And then switch ends. So, yeah, I need to shut down that end. That to forward. Change that to Hadfield. Ah, that's not Hadfield. There we go. And change the lights as well. Um, yeah, I think that's the right one, isn't it? Yeah, we're not direct here. We need to be that one. Wait, what? Uh, I'm lost now. No, not that one. Wait, wait for the messages to go. Right, we are, oh, I've like, completely lost the bloody headlights now, let it bloody go off there, the gloss up one isn't it, that's the one, yeah that's the one. Does it mean to get rid of the back unit? I, I don't know. So it did tell you about uncoupling something, didn't it? Back up the hill, light. Fairly quick, it's very quick accelerating. I'll give it that. See, so yeah, Hadfield's our last stop, um, and we're doing about five minutes. Oh, I see, Pet. What were the ones which ran from Manchester Victoria to uh, Berry, wasn't it? What were those ones? Comes down to 15. Yeah, making our way back up though. Quite a cool little station, that one. The Glossop branch. And yeah, 15's coming up as well. That signal's telling me we're going right.
Let's let it slowly come down. Just a little bit of acceleration. Don't want to sort of come down too quickly. Hopefully that can sort of naturally come down to 15. That's good at the moment. There we go, 15. Let's make sure we don't lose too much speed. Pretty impressive though. Yeah, very nice route. Enjoy that as the bridge there we went over. Hello, pal. The whole line is still open through to Hadfield in Prison Grossop. Uh, the route past Hadfield is closed. Ah. And so was that, was that freight only over that way? As I was like, there doesn't seem to be any passenger stations past Hadfield on here. So I'm guessing it was all just freight. So what's the service pattern like then on this route? I'm guessing it's Hadfield and Glossop to Manchester Piccadilly. Is it the sort of same as this where they're going to Glossop then go back out or... Oh, I see. I got your pet. It used to be double track down there as well. So it's a bit of a state, isn't it? Nice pet. Been a lovely journey though up from Manchester. Used to be passenger at Beach and Cuts got rid of it. Uh, any more streams today? I uh, don't know. I mean, probably, yeah. Uh, I'm tempted to do OMC. Although I'm not too sure yet what time that will be. Should have to wait and see. Yeah. And into Hadfield. Very scenic. Cool. Is there any heritage railways in this area? As if that whole massive stretch of lines being cut, there surely must be some sort of heritage railway around here. Only one. Oh, there's not. Oh, there was that, that, where's the platform for the other side? Just one single platform. A few shopping trolleys as well. Afternoon, Charles. How are you, mate? We're about to go, but thanks for coming in. I really enjoyed that. So, big thanks to Dovetail Games for giving us a key for that. Uh, the reason we got this is it was one of the requirements for the Bluebell Railway. Uh, so, yeah, it's pretty good. That was uh, that was awesome. Uh, but, yeah. Uh, that is going to be everyone uh, for today's train simulator video. Hopefully everyone has enjoyed it. Video stream. Um, I'll be back hopefully later on with a bit of OMC2. Not too sure what map yet. Maybe we'll do some Yorkshire counties again. Not too sure. Yeah, good to hear Charles. I'm all good. Uh, but yeah, hopefully everyone has enjoyed that. Uh, links can be found in the usual places to the Discord server, to the PayPal and to the merch store if you do want to help support the channel. Got a little speeding camera there, a little trophy there. 
But yeah, thanks all for coming in. That was a nice little treat, that. I really enjoyed that. And I hope to see you in the next one. See you all. Take care. Bye, guys.